High pressure continues to dominate across Montana today. However, we are tracking a bit of a cold front this evening. Hey everyone, I'm Jason Laird from the Storm Tracker Weather Center. Well, for the most part, we're looking at sunny and clear conditions pretty much all day here for your Monday. However, there is a bit of a cold front that's going to slide through the state this evening. Likely going to see some stronger storms along that leading edge, primarily north of Great Falls, extending up toward Haver and moving along the northern portions of the state. We do still have one flood warning in place. That is again going to be in Fergus County, just south of Hay for the James Kipp Recreation Area. Uh, river still running right about flood stage, currently set through about 11 o'clock this evening. Uh, we should see that expire as water levels are continuing to drop. As for your low temperatures tonight, cooling off into the 40s and 50s in most locations, 49 in Great Falls, 51 here in Helena, and a few 60s throughout the northeastern plains. As I said, we are tracking a cold front, and this cold front um, combined with basically the the temperature difference between this cold front and uh, the warmer air that we've got planted over top of the state and f uh, factoring in some atmospheric conditions, we could see some stronger storm development this afternoon. So here's how things are going to play out for us. Uh, keep your eye kind of around Cut Bank and Great Falls here. We're going to start to see there's that cold front pushing through, okay, right on the leading edge of that cold front where we'll see a few of those little isolated cells moving throughout. Uh, again, they potentially could become severe. Some small hail gusty winds are potentially expected. Looks like they're going to jet in between Great Falls up toward Lewistown and Haver and then kind of move along the uh, the high line through Glasgow into the early morning hours Tuesday, finally hitting the far northeastern corner of the state by tomorrow morning Tuesday around 11 or so. So a fairly slow moving system and uh, we'll definitely keep our eye right on the leading edge of that system. As for Tuesday's high temperatures though, not bad, cooler than what we uh, have seen here. Um, it looks like that actually should be Nope. Yep. Uh, should be a little bit warmer here in Great Falls. I'll have to correct that. So Great Falls high temperature should be actually about 74 degrees. I know it's reading 60, but we're actually going to be about 74, 77 in Helena and a few 80s throughout the northeastern plains. That's check your forecast. Have a great rest of your Monday.